we are on another road trip and this time we are going to Maryland. Bud's Creek. We've been to uh, a few nationals in a few different states here. We've been to Southwick, uh, we've been to Unadilla a couple of times, been to Parlour Raceway um, and I think that's actually about it uh, so far of the outdoor track. Hello. Well, it's Solomon's Island. Oh. Okay, we're just about to head out to the track. It's about a uh, half an hour drive from here. Um, and I tell you, it feels like Florida. It's like really warm, quite muggy, and there's a forecast for rain today. Definite forecast of rain, not entirely sure exactly when or how much, but yeah. So we've got our wellies in the truck. That's another funky bridge. Look at that. We're going up. Up and up. Well prepared. Let's see. Oh wow, it's quite good. Yeah. Are you ready to fly? Okay, finally here. It's a little bit of a struggle always to to find a parking spot, and all the houses around the event are trying to make money and use their own sort of uh, land around the houses as parking spots. So we parked across the road and. Um, yeah, it's going to be a bottleneck on the way back. Okay, got our tickets and in we go. Have a good day. Hi. I'm so excited again. I get like short of breath. <laughs> like a little kid. <laughs> And this is the track layout of the uh, really cool Bud's Creek MX track. Uh, another one of those classic natural terrain tracks that there are a lot of in the US. That one, one five zero point nine is going to be. Well, we got it. Here we are. We planted ourselves kind of half under the trees, but uh, half exposed. Well, but it's going to be a good spot. I think. <laughs> And let's go racing the first of the 250 motos. Come on, guys. So I found out something today. Uh, they had on the menu, you know, single beers, and then they had um, redneck cooler of beers. Six beers. 
And so uh, I asked them what a redneck cooler was. <laughs> this is what they showed me. It's just a bag with ice in it. That's a redneck cooler. There you go. I love these guys from UK flags. Oh yeah. It's like when their mates are watching them at home on TV. Bud Light. The drink of people who love Bud Light. Now it's time for the first motor of the 450s. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I so want Kenny to um, to have a win. He's uh, got too many points to catch up to Dylan Veranda, so I'm guessing Verandas is going to win this rookie season of his, which is good for him. Sad that Kenny's not going to uh, make it, but uh, he's doing well today. He's out front, and Verandas is going to have to work real hard at trying to catch him if he wants to have a, a win at the end of the day. Okay, what did you get, Ross? Um, I bought a tin of uh, VP Racing Fuel. It's ready mix, so it'll be perfect to put in the bike and it'll be performing to as good as it can. We were Team Jetson today. We are on our way back to the hotel now and um, I'm looking forward to the cold shower and a drink at the end of the day. Yeah, yeah, definitely an, an awesome day, great track, I really loved it and the conditions were just perfect so they had a lot of rain last night but no rain today and the track was moist, a tiny bit dusty in certain parts but not, not too bad. Um, Great days racing. It was a track that seemed to be um, not one line, but certainly there wasn't a whole lot of passing going on today. So, uh, you know, starts were super important, more important than ever. Um, and yeah, 